I'm Rich Bowen. Welcome to the Voice of Apache. Today we're speaking with Yvette Petrova, who we've uh, I, I did an interview with you just recently in Bratislava, and uh, today we're going to be talking about the upcoming CloudStack Collaboration Conference. So thank you for taking time to speak with me. Thank you very much for having me, Rich. Now this conference has been going for like 10 years, right? I mean, this is this is a well-established event. The one that's coming up, and I will uh, I'll put links and more information in the description when I post this, but this is coming up in a little less than a month, November 20th through 22nd in Madrid. Um, I wish I could come. I love Madrid. Uh, tell us something about the conference. Correct, correct, yeah. Uh, the event is about uh, in a month, and uh, for us, for the Apache Cloud Stack community, that's the biggest get together for the community throughout the year. It is a pleasure for us to have the event again as an in-person event. So in the last years, we were trying to have the event every year. Uh, also during the pandemic, we were live streaming the event, so it was just a virtual event. And in the last three years, we are having this as an in-person event. So this year, we're happy to be uh, in the heart of Spain, in Madrid. This conference obviously covers cloud stack and related technologies. Can you give us an idea of what sort of audience you're expecting and what the content will be? The event is mainly around CloudStack and it collects at one place users of the technology like companies from all around the globe. So although the event is in Europe, we have attendees uh, from all around the globe, even from countries like USA, Australia, New Zealand, Canada. Uh, we're happy that we can provide a platform in which we not only have uh, users of the technology, but we also have like the leading contributors and developers of CloudStack. So uh, we start the event with a one day, which is a hackathon in which we enable everybody from the development community to meet together, to exchange new ideas, develop new features, new functionalities for CloudStack. Uh, in addition to the developers and the users of the technologies, we also have integrators and technologies which are complementary to Apache CloudStack. So we have some of storage vendors, networking providers, hardware manufacturers, and our target is to provide a community and ecosystem for the users of the technology in which they can discover all what is new around Apache CloudStack, but also meet complementary technologies around their stack and basically have a central hub of knowledge. Are tickets still available for this event? Yeah, tickets are still available. We also have a lot of free tickets for people who are contributors and committers and PMC members. And we expect to have something around 100 to 150 attendees of the event. Now, I noticed that you had a, a special rate for students. Do you have, do you have content that's specifically focused towards that audience? Yeah, uh, Apache CloudStack is a very inclusive community. So for us, it's important uh, that we also engage with people who are new to the IT, IT world as a whole. That's why we encourage students which are interested in virtualization, in cloud management, also to come and join us. Uh, in addition to the talk, so the event will start with a day of a hackathon. But after that, we have two days in which we will have more than 37 talks. There are also seven uh, hands-on workshops in which people new to CloudStack can really see and they can test the technology and they can learn from people who are experienced uh, in that. So that I really think that if you are a student and if you want to expand your knowledge, learn a new technology, that's a perfect chance in which you can come and you can try and ask people who are in that community from years and have a decade of experience uh, in general with dealing with cloud technologies and building infrastructure. So I recognize quite a few names on the uh, on the speaker list here, including some of your keynotes. Are there particular talks that you'd like to highlight? 
Uh, I think that all of the talks, actually, let's start uh, a bit further. So I think we can divide the talks into several categories. We have uh, the keynotes, of course, which are from a really well-respected people in the IT industry. So the keynotes will give us a bit of more information about how the technology develops at all. Uh, there are some uh, speakers. We have John White from US Signal, which is a very big uh, US-based MSP. We have Sunil Gupta, who is from uh, one of the largest data centers in the world in India, and they will share more in general about open source technologies and why that's the way to go if you want to build a sustainable business. In addition to that, we have talks from users of Apache Cloud Stack, like LeaseWeb, which is like a major hosting and cloud provider, but we also have a lot of talks from developers who are contributing to the project, who will share the newest capabilities, the newest functionalities around cloud stack there will be a sneak peek into the upcoming release which i really hope will be live until november and there are also a lot of talks by users of the technologies like uh, cloud builders who are sharing how they are overcoming everyday challenges thanks to uh, open source software and that's not only limited to cloud stack but i believe that there will be all other uh, Apache software projects, which will be covered in that. Plus, of course, the integrators, which will show why they're integrating their technology with CloudStack. One last question, are there still sponsorship opportunities available for this event? <laughs> Unfortunately not. Uh, uh, and I'm really uh, proud to say that uh, this year we have uh, a record number of sponsors for the event, which makes me extremely happy because uh, the Apache, uh, the Quadstack Collaboration Conference, it's a conference which is organized by volunteers. So we don't have any central budget and we really rely on the sponsors, which are helping us to provide this opportunity for the whole community to be at one place for a few days in the year. Yeah, they can go to the website. There is a large list of sponsors from all kinds of different industries. Uh, and yeah, we're really grateful to all of them for helping us making this event great. Well, thank you so much for your time. Um, like I said, I wish I could come, uh, but uh, not able to come this year. But uh, I hope that's yeah, it's a wonderful event. And uh, thank, thank you for you. speaking with us. Thank you very much, Rich. We really hope to have you next year. Uh, yeah, when we know when is the next location of the event, uh, we will invite you for sure. <laughs>